Hey everyone, it's Killer King Kevin and the Venom skin is finally in the item shop so you can get the whole bundle for 2000 V-Bucks. So it is, I think the cheapest Fortnite bundle, like the Marvel bundle, let me actually check. 2200, yup. Oh, uh, you have like the other skins, but from this season, it's the cheapest bundle. You get a pickaxe, inbuilt emote, and you get a back bling as well. So it is actually a really, really cool, uh, insane bundle and the skin's reactive as well. I wouldn't say reactive, but it's like animated and it also has a different edit style. So I'm just gonna put on everything with the Venom skin. You've got the Tendril Tote Back Bling. Pickaxe is the Symbiotic Slasher. Now the thing with this pickaxe is that you can only use it with the skin. Um, let me actually see if I can equip something else. Let's use Joker Pickaxe. Okay, well you can. You can actually use other pickaxes. I thought uh, you could only use this pickaxe for this skin. Uh, it doesn't have a glider, but I'm just going to put on the glider. But this is everything for the, I guess, the Venom skin. And then it also has the different edit style. So you've got the default style. And you've got the extreme style. So in this one, uh, as you can see, the animation is more and it looks more, I guess, venomy. You can even see like the venom slime. It's kind of, a bit, it's like super weird. Uh, it goes out more from his body as well. Uh, I think there's a bit of a blue glow. Uh, yeah, th there's a bit of a blue glow while, yep, as you can see, oh my God, look at the face. That looks creepy. But you can see the glow. Let me go back to this one. Yep, there's no... Oh, there is a blue glow, but it's not as much. And, and the face, when you look at the face, um, in the other one, it looks like the mouth is kind of like cut out. So take if you take a look at the mouth from the side, and then take a look at this one. Oh, that just... oh that, that, That's kind of creepy, but it is actually a really, really cool skin. So I'm just going to jump into a game and see if it's like what it does while you're in the game everything with the pickaxe and the back bling as well okay so i'm in battle lab and like right off the bat you can see the the venom animation just on the skin i'm not sure what that's called let me know what it's actually called um i'm just gonna call it i like I, i'm not sure what the actual black stuff like the slime's called i know it's like venom but uh oh oh my god okay it actually does have an animation i thought it would just like move around while at the back but it does move while you're jumping so if i go right the thing will go left oh, i will just go to the opposite direction so it's like different way the back bling doesn't actually do much for now for now the back bling is not doing anything maybe if i get a kill it will like explode not exactly sure oh the pickaxe it even has a blue glow Look, right, it's kind of hard to see, but there's like a bluey glow. Oh, it only happens when you hit. It doesn't happen when you actually... So when you hit, if you look at the thing, you'll see like a blue splash. It's like a venom splash. That is actually pretty cool. The, the back bling doesn't seem to be doing much. And something that's weird is the fact that the back bling color is black and the venom skin is like... A dark dark blue compared to the back bling. I wish they were kind of the same color. I don't know why they're different. The pickaxe is really cool though. I wish they were kind of the same color so it just matched the skin but for some reason it's a it's a different color. But I mean it's fine it's fine. I'm just gonna see if I can get a like a bot. Let me see if I does anything happen if I check splash up. Nope. Nothing happens. He is bigger than your average, like, skin. So it's like Brutus size, I think. So I got enemy bot. Let me... Okay, so let me actually just... Chuck one. Ooh! The back bling is reactive! Okay, so the skin isn't, but the back bling is. It just, like, explodes. Okay, ready? Oh my god. Yep, the back bling kind of just like fuzzes out. The skin, yeah, the skin actually doesn't do anything. It's just the back bling. It's reactive. I'm not sure if it even has the reactive tag on it. Oh, the pickaxe, it, it, it's so weird. 
because I, I always think he's not holding it, but he actually is. Like, it's just inbuilt. Plus, it seems longer than your other pickaxes. That is so cool. The pickaxes, like, the way they make all the Marvel skins unique, like, not all of them, but the way they've added it, like, different, like, with the Ghost Rider one, they had the chains, which just made it amazing. Captain America had the shield, which goes off his back bling and everything. Um, Black Widow, I don't think she had anything special, like, anything new or different. Um, with the Venom, like, the pickaxe, something new. So, it's actually really cool how they've done it for, like, basically most of the skins. Um, besides the backling, I don't think it does anything else. Yeah, it has the same style, and every time you get a kill, it will just do that same style. So that is the, I guess, the first edit style. Okay, before I jump in, I just realized I forgot about the emote. Uh, the We Are Venom emote. It's inbuilt. Let me just do that. Okay, that is creepy. <laughs> and it gets rid of the pickaxe in your hand. So it actually does have hands. So if you switch, it gets rid of the, the hand pickaxe, but the emote is actually pretty insane as well. I've got the second edit style and like right off the bat, you can see there's like white stuff. Um, like he's got like white Sharpie stuff on the, on the side of his arms. I'm not sure what that is, but you can see it's got like spikes. Kind of looks like bones, but I don't think the bones... It could be like spider webs. I'm not exactly sure. They do look like bones though, but that's kind of creepy. Like the bones just like ripped it from his hand. I got an enemy bot and a friendly bot. Ooh. Oh my God. Okay. In the extreme style, like the venom bit is just so much more. Like you just have this fuzzy stuff everywhere. No, not fuzzy, but the venom stuff everywhere. The pickaxe... Oh, wait. I feel like the pickaxe has more of an animation. It looks like it, but I doubt. Like, I wouldn't say more of an animation. It just has more of the venom effect. It just looks like more venom. But look at this. It's just everywhere you go, it's got that trail. It basically has that venom trail. Let me see if I can get an enemy bot. And if it's different, let me, this time, let me do the emote first. So, we are Venom emote. It looks the same. It's exactly the same. It's not, like, different. But, um, I guess it just has more of an effect because of the, the Venom-y stuff that, that's, like, going around. So, let me get a enemy bot. That's enemy bot and a pump. Wow. I always get a the, the bot grenades and the pump at the same time for some reason. Okay. So, let me kill. Okay, let me kill without ADS so it looks... Ooh, I'm not sure. No, the skin is definitely not reactive or like the skin doesn't react to your kills. Uh, only the thing does. And it's the same animation, just like the normal edit style. Um, but... It might look re like the skin might look reactive only because of the animation and the animation is just happening like the whole time It's not like for the kill you're getting it So yeah, the animation it just happens when it happens It's nothing to do with reactive um, They could have had a Eddie Brock style where like you start off with that skin and then when you use the emote It like turns into venom like the whole venom engulfs the character that would have been in like that would have been next level so you're literally and they could have definitely done it because they've done it with so many skins like i remember the scientist skin i think it's called the doctor where it turns from a doctor to a werewolf so with the venom skin they could have had like a normal human being and then the venom just comes out from the back bling and then engulfs the skin turning it into venom that would have been really really insane but it's a really cool bundle, 2,000 V-Bucks. I think that's like the perfect price for everything that you're getting. Uh, I, I think the only reason it is cheaper is because um, you can only use the pickaxe with the Venom skin. So I think that's why they like lowered it. But yet again, the skin is absolutely amazing. So if you're, if you're trying to pick up a like Marvel bundle and you're confused which one to get, 
uh, I would suggest getting either the Venom bundle or the Ghost Rider bundle. The only reason I say Ghost Rider as well is because the pickaxe with the Ghost Rider skin, the, the glider with the Ghost Rider skin is really, really amazing. But the Venom skin itself is better than the... Um, like the Ghost Rider skin. So the bundle, uh, Ghost Rider bundle is pretty cool. But the skin, like I just, this is just amazing. So let me know uh, what are your thoughts on the Venom skin and which like Marvel bundle you like the most. I hope this video does help. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment on this video.